uh, he's moving from one top job to another. Is this a promotion? Yes, well, Annalise, there's a chorus of voices for many weeks calling on Masson to be fired. And indeed, he was stripped of his role as domestic intelligence chief, but quite quickly given a better job. He will be state secretary as a deputy head of the Interior Ministry, a role which will give him a pay rise, and also ultimately more of a say in the direction of domestic politics in Germany. And this was seen as a compromise between uh, the leaders of the Conservative parties um, and Horst Seehofer of the Interior Ministry, who was, who was trying to protect Masson and saying he should stay and the Social Democrats who wanted him to go but many members of the Social Democrats are not happy with the outcome of yesterday's meeting and uh, they say that uh, that Marson has been promoted and this should not have happened the deputy leader of the Social Democrats um, Ralph Stegner is, is saying he's absolutely outraged by this Lars Klingbeil the general secretary of the party saying this is a very curious decision and raises a lot of questions and Katrin going Eckhart who's the leader of Germany's Green Green Party uh, says, quote, this is an incredible fudge. Uh, instead of being punished uh, for disloyalty and for cozying up to the far right alternative for Germany party, Masson has been rewarded, end quote. And I think her feelings are really what we're seeing playing out in the media and social media reactions to um, Masson's new job. This is a man who was embroiled in scandal and he's now been given a foot up the career ladder. All right, Jessica. Jessica, um, this is a very big political scandal, yet uh, another problem for Angela Merkel. How is she likely to be affected by all this? Well, Marsen's appointment to the Interior Ministry is a, a curious one for Angela Merkel to agree to because Marsen, like Seehofer, is a, is a big critic of her migration politics. And now the two will be working very closely in the Interior Ministry on migration policy. So this could spell trouble for Angela Merkel. But I think this is a real sign of the fact that she is still being forced to bend to the demands of uh, Interior Minister Horst Seehofer, who wanted to keep Marsen in the fold. Um, we're seeing Angela Merkel really on the back foot as leader now. She's being forced to give in to the demands of her coalition partners and, uh, and really tr in an effort, desperate effort to try and keep the government from falling apart. So we're seeing a leader who's reacting rather than leading from the front and this could spell trouble for the German Chancellor moving forward.